Hey guys, welcome back. Um, so I figured I'd show you quickly what I'm bringing to uh, Oktoberfest in Greenfield, Massachusetts, which will be tomorrow, I believe, from uh, like 10 to 10, basically. Um, so first, and there are a bunch of Pokemon underneath this, as you will see. I gotta try and go fast. So first up are these, um, I believe these are vintage... Uh, let me just double check. I think these are 80s, 90s. Yeah, so these are vintage muscle car cards. You know, there's a whole bunch of different ones in here. I'll be bringing these. These are like $2 each, but I'll end up doing like a deal on that. Um, they go for $2 each, but I'll probably do one for two or two for three dollars so that's you know gives you a dollar off and you can get a couple of them uh i haven't actually thought about how much i do the whole lot for but you know we'll deal with that when we get there uh next up is uh, oh i taped it in so let's try to untape this if i can Gotta be careful, I don't have single-sided tape at the moment. Uh, and the only reason these are like this is because I don't currently have an extra box. So I'm going to be bringing a bunch of uh, base set Korean, um, Korean Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Show you just a handful here. Legend of Blue Eyes, equivalent to base set bunch of them there's like three a pack two to three a pack uh they sell for a dollar each so i'll be selling those there um and you know there's some there's actually a few good ones in there i gotta put my sleeves in there extra sleeves in there before i forget so i'm just gonna set this aside for now um okay let's put that aside too um I'll also be bringing a bunch of first edition, you know, just common first edition, not in the best condition, uh, but there's a, there's a good amount, and, uh, I, I figure they're about $10 cards, $10 worth of cards, uh, when I looked up the price, it came up to 17 so that's $7 off, so that's pretty good, and I'll just do that for the lot, um, then we have... Uh, basically Pokemon repacks this took me like three days to do um, you know one day two days three days and that's the equivalent of three booster boxes I made sure that there were no uh, doubles uh, and every one has at least a rare there's guaranteed foils there's a bunch of stuff in there bunch of goodies and I made sure that you know you get at least one guaranteed rare or foil and uh, yeah and it's basically the same uh, pull rate as a regular booster pack on top of that which I'm using to divide I'm I uh, am gonna be bringing the EV playmat the shining radiant EV playmat uh, which we pulled out of the 14,000 card opening if you haven't seen it yet please go and take a look at that uh, it cost me $400 and it doesn't have enough views unfortunately to you know make it worth the while but it was fun to do and it uh, the people that did watch were very excited about that these uh, are as you can tell these are made for a vending machine these are going to be put into the vending machine at uh, friendly town pizza in Orange Massachusetts right at the uh, the plaza there um, and these are going to be big winners where there's multiple good foils in there, um, that are no longer printed according to, uh, PTGO, I believe, big YouTuber. Um, yeah, so those are going to be going with me. Um, and those are, pro these will probably be the main Thing. I might bring a binder of uh, Pokemon Go and, you know, set 
2017 to recent there. Um, so, uh, you know, I, I don't want too much. I'm going to be limited on space. I kind of really want to try and, you know, make it so that it's as hard to, or as easy to transport, you know, and keep it tabs on because there's going to be thousands of people there. Um, so unfortunately, due to the cost of having full-length Pokemon opening videos, um, and unfortunately due to rising cost of living, um, I will no longer be able to release full-length videos. Uh, so what I will be doing is I will, will be releasing shorter videos. Um, and unfortunately, just have to go about doing that. Because um, I, I just, I can't afford to, uh, I, I, I can't afford to keep spending, you know, $200 a month, unfortunately, on Pokemon. Um, you know, it's, it's a bit out of my means. Um, I, I do have, I will be announcing a challenge to uh, Deep Pocket Monster soon for a collection battle. Um, he'll most likely win. He's got, he's got the money to be able to get some of the good stuff. But I got some good stuff too. I've been collecting, you know, pretty much since the beginning. So I'll be doing that. Um, what else? There was one more thing. Um, I will be doing more often uh, shorts. Uh, such as Who's That Pokemon? Um, and I will also be announcing um, a special giveaway. Um where I'll be giving something special away from my collection uh, if I am able to reach a certain amount of subscribers within a certain amount of time. Uh, and I think that will be pretty fun. I, I don't, I have low hopes or low expectations that it will actually occur. But, you know, you can only, you can only hope, you know. Um... Uh, but I'm basically just trying to do whatever I can to keep this channel afloat while being able to keep my life on track. Um, you know, my bike is, excuse me, my bicycle is completely destroyed. It's uh, totaled and that's going to be like a thousand dollar replacement cost for the type I need uh, for my body with all the injuries. Uh, my phone, camera one, recently uh, broke, and that's going to be at least a $100 rep, uh, repair cost, as I have a bunch of the pack openings from this month on that phone, um, you know, I, I just, my expenses are through the roof, I also owe, uh, $400, uh, to the loan, or to pay off a loan that my family gave me, to uh, help pay for the vending machine when the credit card company uh, decided that they were going to uh, s technically screw me over and say, you can't put money on your card, you can't take money off your card, and you can't use that card to pay for purchases. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm guessing that's going to be pretty much it. I'm thinking I might do a slot in my vending machine where it's, um, as you see, I have, uh, oh, I guess you can't see, but underneath there, slot one holds about that many cards, uh, 35, 60, you know, a little bit over 100, and I have three slots open. I'm going to be taking out the Yu-Gi-Oh, because people only buy it because they want to get a variety, uh, and I just, I don't have that much to continue giving a variety. Uh, Yu-Gi-Oh is part of... Oh, I also owe oh, 200 apparently to 
PayPal who shut down my account so I can't technically pay them until they unlock my account, but they refuse to and I can't get a hold of them until they unlock my account. So, until that gets fixed, yeah, um, you know, a couple thousand dollars I need to do. Plus, I want to uh, buy another machine, get new locations, um, because that's, that's where my, my money's coming in, honestly. I'm, I make, uh, I pull 60 out of the machine on average, and I make about 40 from that. Um, yeah, I make 40 from that if I pull 60, because I get 30%. Uh, and they were honestly the best I could find in this area to to, to uh, deal with. Um, but yeah, so that's what's going on. Uh, it would mean the world if you liked the video if you subscribed, and, uh, you know, I, I don't believe anyone is ever gonna make it to this point, uh, because even my subscribers only watch, like, one video a month, and, uh, yeah, but, you know, you gotta have hope, so I'm gonna still give out codes, I'm gonna give out a few codes, that's not a code, what the heck? Ooh, Rebel Clash, that's a good one. Ooh, here's another good one. XY Evolutions. Ooh, and Guardians Rising. Oh, yeah. Guardians Rising, some pretty good codes, honestly. Alright, uh, thank you for uh, watching. Let me know what you think. If you have any questions, comments, um, let me know. Uh, I will not be able to reply tomorrow as I will be there and uh with my other phone broken you know there's nothing I can do as the phone I'm recording on now does not have internet outside the house it's just basically a YouTube phone where I watch YouTube uh anyway thank you have a great day don't forget to treat others the way you want to be treated